Hi, I'm Lee Hunt, Principal Horticultural Advisor for the RHS. Today we're looking at the science we found out about why hedges are so much better than fencing. This ranges from things like helping our wildlife to trapping pollution. And we're going to go around Whistley Gardens and look at the hedges and explain how this all works. Autumn is a great time to get planting. You can buy these plants for hedging cheaply online or in garden centres. They usually come as bundles. When you get them home, split them up and then get planting. A fence might seem like the obvious option when planning a garden, but I'd really encourage you to go for a hedge instead. Not only do they look much nicer, but they're really cost effective, particularly when you consider that they're going to last a lifetime. This is a hornbeam hedge. As well as looking really great, it's actually great at preventing flooding. It does this by having a large surface area to the leaf and when the rain lands on it, it traps it temporarily and that slows the rate at which all the rain reaches the drains. Additionally, when it transpires, it releases a lot of moisture into the atmosphere and that reduces the pressure on the drains as well. Along with things like hornbeam, we know that hawthorn, forsythia, privet and cotoneaster are all great at helping with this, preventing of flooding. Beach hedges are great for supporting wildlife, as well as being homes for insects. Birds can nest and roost in them as well. This is just a beach hedge, but we could add hawthorn and dog rose, and that would make a great mixed hedge, supporting even more wildlife, as well as looking great. Another way to help wildlife in your garden is introducing a hedge with flowers and fruit. Not only will it feed the birds and insects, but it also looks really good and makes a surprising choice for an informal hedge in the garden. Use a great choice for both capturing pollution and for reducing noise. This is where bigger hedges really work well. So the higher and wider you can go, the more effect they have. For things like pollution, the hedge is actually capturing that particulate pollution, dust-like particles, on the rough, hairy and scaly parts of its leaves. These then get washed to the ground, taking them out of the air. For noise pollution, it is acting like a barrier, and that's why wider is better. As well as something like you, Thuya works really well. These are just two reasons why you is a great all-round hedge. It also supports wildlife and is low maintenance. As part of the Greening Great Britain campaign, the RHS is asking all gardeners to swap walls and fences for hedges. No matter whether you've got a big garden or a small garden, now's the time to get out and plant.